Hello and welcome to Final Word. In this section, I'm talking with Peter Torrey, who is lead architect of the service provider group at Intel. Peter, welcome. We've just completed the SDN NFV panel on why those particular technologies are the vogue at the moment. Now, Intel is intimately involved in developing products and to work on SDN and to exploit NFV. What are they? What are you doing? Yeah. So, so this comes to the to the multi-year investments in the roadmap, especially on the server product lines. And, and uh, in, in particular, we have something that is fundamentally driving this progress forward. It's called the TikTok model, which means uh, one year we invest into new microarchitecture. The next year we invest into the shrink of the manufacturing process. And with this uh, two-year cadence, this type of thing switch forward. Yeah. So basically, every few years, you just get faster and faster server products out of it. And um, it has a huge adoption by all the OEMs, and, and we have uh, excellent uh, alignment on all these type of product lines with HP, as an example. So, so this drives the fundamental platform performance. We have uh, things in the hardware, again, so, so either we have something which is well proven and adopted in all the processors from all the product lines from laptops and everything else. There's a couple of instructions accelerating encryption in the CPU, but only one block cipher called advanced encryption standard because it's used all over. So from full disk encryption to, to accelerating IPsec, web, web uh, traffic and these type of things. But then to, to go after more algorithms, we cannot put this into the CPU. We put it into the chipset and sometimes on the cards. So the idea is to have uh, multiple encryption algorithms, pattern matching, and compression algorithms accelerated in that chipset. Many of these things that fit together, but the idea is to build an optimized and trusted, but also open in terms of open source or, or open standards type of nodes. Okay. Peter Tony, thank you very much indeed. Thank you.